Well, I'm back working on the boat. Uh, after a week of uh, craziness with Irma rolling through and causing a lot of tree damage and power outages, which people still are out of power. It's been over a week. It's, uh, it's Thursday today and it rolled through not the last Sunday, but the Sunday before. And some of my neighbors up the way still don't have power. We don't have cable or Wi-Fi, anything like that. Um, but I'm, I finally got the boat out of the garage and I've been working on it. <clears throat> Let me show you what I've uh, accomplished at this point. The floor is almost done. Uh, I'll give you a little walk through over there. Spider web, avoid that. But I got the floor. That's a leaf on there. But uh, I got the floor in there. I've painted the whole boat. Painted all the white. I got the gas tank back in. Got the battery back in. I put a, a non-skid on the floor. Painted painted all the sides. I didn't paint the blue. Painted the white. Painted the top. I got a little bit left to paint around the bottom in there. Paint turned out pretty good. I've had the boat outside for about two days and it seems to rain on me constantly. And I'll look at the radar and think, oh, all right, let me get a coat of paint. And then two minutes later, it's raining on me, which is uh, not, what you're, not what you want. <clears throat> I painted that white on the bottom there. I got some hardware to put back on. She's looking good though. I put my uh, Bimini back up. Let me get a shot from further away so you can see. I got the Bimini back on. I bought all new hardware, all stainless steel hardware. I've got to attach my cleats, my light back on here. I still have to attach my seats. I haven't put the seats back on yet, but it looks good. I got two coats of paint on the floor. I'm going to put one more coat of paint over top of the non-skid because it's pretty rough right now. I don't want it really rough. I just didn't want to slip on that paint because it probably was pretty slippery. 